unite against cancer. We have a lot of use of various, some of the med, uh, medicines that you have mentioned, especially artesanate, artesamine, which we use for malaria. And as you know, um, we have a particular type of Burkitt's lymphoma that is endemic, that is common in malaria endemic areas. And yeah. also you mentioned the issue of resistance and the ability to reverse resistance. Uh, uh, we have a high chloroquine resistance, and it was with the advent and the coming into the markets of our testinates that we were able to um, address malaria more effectively. So I think that it's important that we continue to advocate for a lot of research that looks at the holistic combination of these therapies that are uh, homegrown in China and in combination with um, uh, Western oncology medications and methods. You also mentioned uh, the use of acupuncture and dietary inputs. A lot of cancer patients living with cancer are now understanding and very much value the importance of having a holistic approach that looks at not just the medications that they're swallowing in, but of course things like, that you mentioned like acupuncture, exercise, uh, as well as dietary input. So well done, Professor Fan and your team, and thank you so much uh, for sharing this experience with us. My final question is that, you know, we have seen some of these good things. We have, you have spoken at length about them. How do you think we can move the needle forward globally uh, so that we can integrate uh, the two sciences and have more inputs? Yes, there are some alternative uh, holistic medication on the market, but how can we um, move it forward and how do you see the future of cancer control in China as it relates to the world? See, uh, I can see uh, with um, the, um, the high confidence the feature for cancer control in China is uh, promising. The blueprint to uh, close the cancer care gap and achieve a healthy China by uh, 2030 is ambitious but possible. We need to uh, prioritize the several actions to make this uh, reality. First, to uh, advance the re realization of a right to uh, e uh, equitable, the healthcare, healthcare resources must be integrated and the resource allocations optimized. All the, um, the sectors of the society must uh, work together to combine resources to enhance cancer control. Second, that uh, uh, propel the public health education and uh, the promotion of scientific knowledge, empowering the health care, the professionals and the public with information on management of the all stage of the cancer continuum, prevention, screening, diagnosis, treatment, and recovery. Third, the healthcare system should be demand oriented to meet the needs of cancer patients and people affected by cancer. The healthcare professionals working in cancer and the wider public. If um, we can prioritize these uh, actions to close the cancer care gap, and uh, uphold the equal right to health. I believe China can begin joining the French line in the blueprint for Health China by 2030. With the aim of achieving the overall five-year cancer 
survival rate of uh, 46.6 percent by 2030. We will next focus on the controlling cancer risk factors to reduce the incidence, improve it, uh, improve the prevention and treatment service system, promote early diagnosis and treatment with uh, strengthened long-term screening mechanisms the boost the uh, booster of the standardization of the diagnosis and the treatment and to reduce the medical burden for people kaka will continue to uh, collaborate with uh, uh, international colleagues to exchange ideas and experiences to in order to improve the overall health care capacities organize the public education campaigns to increase the public awareness on cancer prevention and treatment, and to ultimately reduce the incidence and the mortality rate of cancer, promote CACAC for more standard ways of uh, the cancer uh, diagnosis and the treatment used by child doctors, and to improve your survival rate and the quality of uh, life for cancer patients. And as you know, so um, in the November, we will have um, our uh, uh, national uh, national uh, the cancer meeting uh, to a joint held by the AOS. And AOS means uh, Asia uh, Oncology um, Society. That uh, yes, I'm uh, the the president of the, that society, and also we were uh, found the uh, the new organization and of anti cancer nationwide. That means the World Association for um, uh, the Integrative um, uh, 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 Integrative mm -hmm. Oncology. So, um, the, so uh, many work is so we want to collaborate with uh, and, and, and it's internationally that was also so you are very very important person uh, to join us so so, so that is uh, <laughs> why we invite you to uh, to uh, to attend this uh, um, um, the grand, the grand meeting we hope to uh, uh, to meet you face to face that uh, several several months later. So thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you, Professor. I really appreciate that. In line with what you said, I can bear witness that uh, my country, Nigeria, which is a high population country like China as well, with over 200 million people, uh, not up to China, but high considerably, uh, has also, there is a bilateral government agreement whereby uh, people that are involved in healthcare, particularly medical laboratory scientists, early oncologists, are sponsored to go to China to learn more research methods, uh, methods for diagnosis and treatment. And uh, the, the program is a joint program between the governments of China and Nigeria, and it's going very well. And it cuts across different aspects of development. So uh, thank you for the invitation once again. And we look forward to seeing you once more in China for your annual meeting, which is a very large meeting. I must say I have never attended a meeting that is so uh, well attended, not just by people and students from within China, but also by international partners. So it's a very good meeting and well done for organizing that. So the last thing we're going to ask you to do now is to just uh, say with passion the words United Against Cancer. I'd say, so I would like to say unite against cancer or unite to uh, anti-cancer, right? Yes, <laughs> thank you. That's great. Thank, thank you, you so right. much, Professor. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Onka Daily on YouTube. Hit the bell icon to stay updated.